Tellum Tribe Tarot. Daily readings for my tribe. Subscribe to my channel. Grand Rising. I am Cherokee with Tellum Tribe Tarot. Coming to you with another reading. This is going to be a general reading for the collective about what to expect today and how to maneuver. You know, we have to face our day the best way that we know how. Some of us plan ahead. Some of us just, you know, go with what happens spontaneously. After all, that is all that we can do. And it's good to have a bit of a synopsis of what to expect and how to deal with it so you're not reactive. Take what resonates, leave behind what does not. Subscribe to my channel. Drop a comment to say Grand Rising. Don't be rude. <laughs> and let's get into your reading. Again, this is for all signs. And that's on that. So let's see. So overall energy of today is the two of wands. So you're going to have some decisions that you have to make today. Every day is a decision-making day. Know that. Um, what you won't expect is the five of wands energy. So based on that decision, whatever decision that you decide, it's going to cause or may cause some conflict or may cause some conflict within yourself. And the expected is the strength card because you will be able to deal with this no matter what that decision is. So I feel like this is definitely going to have to do with a monetary situation or something that's going to be affecting your money. So this could be a decision at work. Some of you may be considered, uh, considered for a promotion or some of you may be getting a pay cut. Um, or it could just simply be uh, deciding between the job that you currently have and another job or deciding between two jobs and you're unemployed. Or it could be could be something that has nothing to do with your employer or your way how you make money. And it can be dealing with something personal outside of work that's going to affect the way how you spend money. But either way, that decision is weighing on your heart today. Um, I see that your guides are challenging you in this way because things have got things have been coasting quite a bit for you. Um, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo energies are present. Um, Leo energy heavy present. Um, I feel like you're being challenged because this is something that you asked for. I feel like someone feels that their life has just been like a blah. And you have to be careful what you ask for because when you ask the universe when you ask the universe generally for things and you're not specific, it'll show up for you, but it won't show up exactly as how you were trying to manifest it. Or I even feel like some of you don't even realize how strong your words are by saying things as simply as like, I wish my life was more exciting. You don't say how exciting you want it to be. You don't say how you want the excitement to show up. So then when things are uprooted and it creates some excitement and excitement can instill fear, excitement can also instill happiness. But if you're not prepared for what's coming, it will certainly excite you in ways that you were unprepared for. So here you are today, it's Monday, and you're trying to figure out what this day is going to look like, understand that there's a decision that you have to make. Your spirit guides are asking you to be logical about it and also intuitive. Listen to your heart. Listen to your intuition. What makes sense best for you um, in this situation? Let's get more insight and don't sit on this decision. It is a split decision. Twos are here. I feel like you're being put in this situation because there's a change that needs to happen in your life and you have been sitting on that change. You want, you may want to move, you know, you may be in the process of moving or you're considering moving and you're not sure if you should take that step to move 
And here is the decision that you need to make. Your guides are saying, whether you decide to move or not, it's not going to be a consequence of your action, but rather um, an end result. There's going to be a reaction to whichever decision that you choose, whether you decide to move or not. And I'm talking about moving house, moving home, moving apartment, or moving forward with your job or moving forward with this job versus the next or taking that promotion promotion or staying the same or accepting that pay cut and remaining where you are. You know, your guides are saying either way, you have to decide what is best for you and not feel guilty about it because you're protected either way. I sense that you want someone to make the decision for you or you're not comfortable making that decision for yourself. And that's why the conflict comes in with the um, five of wands, excuse me, I said this uh, five of wands earlier, but it's still the same thing. Conflict, seven of wands, but you fighting through this, this time frame. That's the unexpected. You fighting with the decision of, of, of loss or you fighting with the decision of a win. You're not sure what that's going to look like. But there's going to be a lot of movement after you make this decision, whether you go forward or not. Your guides are with you with this eight of wands energy. The five of wands that, and that I thought I saw, it's actually your internal conflict. It's just the energy of the wands. It's really fiery. And look, the unexpected, right, is that you're going to make a decision today and you're going to stick with it. And guess what? The decision that you make, your guides are saying any decision that you move forward with is going to work in your favor. You know why? Because you're going with your flow of things and you're finally taking life into your hands and, and allowing things to be. The message today really is to accept what you cannot change and change what you can and move with grace when things are not going your way. You may be feeling like all odds are against you right now. I feel like someone feels like something is plaguing them, like someone is trying to take them under or a force is trying to take them under. Someone feels like they are under a spell. They can't get up out of this, this, this spell bound situation. But here's the kicker. That spell is your mind, your mind waiting on you to decide because your thoughts are so clouded with doubt and uncertainty. And here your spirit guides are saying that all you need to do is pick an action and be confident in that action, in that decision that you're making, because this is a decision that has to be made regardless. And you do not want that decision to be made for you. You want to have that power. You want to take control. This is something that you have the authority to take control of. This is your life to live. And today is no different a day than any to decide on what you want to do for yourself. I feel like with this Ace of Wands energy as the unexpected, I feel like the door, the floodgates of, of, um, of certainty is going to open up for you. Like you're going to feel re a release, like the world is no longer on your shoulder. And then now you're going to be tasked with the responsibility of planning. So if you did decide that, okay, well, y'all want to cut, you know, y'all making pay cuts. If it's a job situation, then you're like, all right, well, I know my skill set. I know it's going to be a little bit difficult. I've been working here for a hot minute. And this is what you want to bring to me on this Monday morning, right before I have my coffee. That's fine. That's fine. I'm going to keep on working and doing my best. And while I'm there, I'm going to find another situation. You know what I'm saying? Or I'm going to work with you and show you why you're making a mistake because I know that you need me, but I don't need this. But either way, it's just your mindset that your spirit guides are telling you to focus on. If you notice, there are no swords here. So it's very important that you take action and be mindful about that action that you're taking today. Think before you decide. But the goal today is to take action. 
That's what your guides want. The chariot is moving. The sevens are here because a cycle is going to be completed and another one is going to begin when you decide today that your life is in your own hands and no one else's and it is your responsibility to take action and the strength that you thought you didn't have is right there for you to, to, um, to utilize, to manifest the next step in your path or on your path. Don't be afraid to decide today, loves. I know it may feel as if everything is counting against you, but look, look at these majors that's coming out for you. If you do this with grace and love, if you do this out of the goodness of your heart, you don't retaliate against anything that's happening to you today. You just use the strength that you know you have and you amicably move through like the grace, the full of grace and honor and respect and dignity and tact. Nothing can move you. Okay? Nothing can move you. So I feel like the message for you today is no matter what comes your way, don't react to it. Glide, but decide. All right? So I hope this resonates with someone today. If you would like to book a personal reading, the link is in the description. Subscribe to my channel. Say hello to a goddess in the comments. Turn on post notifications. Share the video to share the wealth because someone needed to hear this today. And until next time, love and light, tribe.